my plane was just about to crash. So I grabbed my bag and took out my big blue parachute to glide me down and land. The plane the poet traveling by was about to crash. In order to save himself from the plane crash, he took out a blue parachute from his bag and got ready to jump from the plane. He started searching for a better place to land. At last, I found a spot to land, but there was a big breeze and so I had to painfully land on these sharp pine trees. Finally, the poet found a better place to land, but the terrible breeze worried the poet. As there was no other alternative, he jumped from the plane to save his life. With a great pain, he landed on sharp pine trees. I was then filled with bruises as a pine fell on my ear. I sat down on the ground to rest. A thorn then poked my rear. He landed on the ground with many injuries on his body. He got hurt as a pine fell on his ear. As he was tired, anxious and distressed, he felt relieved after landing on the ground and took rest for some time. A thorn poked his ear when he laid down on the bare ground to take rest. He slowly fell asleep despite the mental instability caused due to the unhappy events that occurred. I slept on the ground frantically. Mosquitoes bit my nose. Bugs crept into my underpants and tickled my ten toes. The conditions did not let him sleep comfortably with mosquitoes biting him on his nose. Bugs creeping all over his body and tickling his toes disturbed his sleep. I scratched myself when I woke up, appearing like a fool, and after the whole thing I thought I would rather go to school. He felt himself a fool when he woke up and scratched himself. It made him to accept the truth that his student life was better and he would go to school rather than going on an adventure.